Hi, welcome to Relish Force. We're playing a relic of my childhood today, Gauntlet Dirt Legacy. Now then, I just, I just fucking adore this game. Like, I can hit start. Oh, okay. Yeah, and you basically make your own profile, and um, the cool thing about this stuff is that um, certain names uh -huh. have, like, cheats to them. Really? Yeah, you can put in names and they're cheat codes, basically. We're not gonna do that here, because that's fucking lame, but... Oh, there we go, that's buttons. Alright. But, My name. for example, if you put in purple, it would give you max meter all the time, so you could just spam your special attacks. 10,000k would give you shitloads of money. Stuff like that. So, me and my friends, uh, back in the day, when I was probably like 8 or 9, we would sit down here at my house and we would burn through this game. And we all had our, like, designated The cool thing about the game is that, to keep it, like, straight for everyone, is that there's a bunch of different classes, like Sorcerer, uh, Dwarf, Archer, Wizard, Valkyrie, stuff like that, right? And a bunch of hidden ones you can as well. But, if you hit up on it, you get different colors to choose from, yeah. with different designs each. Cool. And I was always the yellow jester when I played as a kid. Really? Don't don't use the cheat. You better be putting in purpley. Don't you dare put in a cheat. Boca. Uh. Don't put in purple, please. Holy crap! There's a lot of characters in this game. Yeah, and they each have four different designs based on the color you pick. Oh no! Don't do that, it's lame! I won't use the spam. I won't spam it. Do you want me to change it? Yeah, please, like you don't know how broken it is. It is the most broken thing on earth. Alright, so basically pick your person. And um, I will tell you that the announcer is simultaneously the most. For I don't know why yellow is all the black people. Yeah, really though. <laughs> oh yeah, the, the yellow Mr. North looks like Mr. T. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> shit, yeah! Do you want him? Yeah, I actually do. Alright, hit it, hit it, and who oh, you want to no. be, and you'll get to hear the most, best announcer in all of gaming. I do want to see, like, what all the stats are. Valkyrie's kind of tanky, though. <sighs> it won't matter. It won't matter? Okay. You can, basically, once you get a lot of money in game, you can just buy all their stats. Oh. Uh, 600, They do feel different at the start, though. Alright, so just uh, everybody gets to hear the, the sickness of this voice. Oh, jeez. <laughs> like, sounds oh, of my no. childhood, man. Sounds of my childhood. Uh, I'm definitely Mr. T, though. <laughs> definitely Mr. T. <laughs> me? You named yourself me? Oh, yeah. Problem? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna warn you now, we played this a little bit earlier today, just me and Amy, and um, she was like, I'm gonna play the Sorceress, and she was the most over-sexualized thing in the world. Oh, really? Like, it was pain- like, just use- do the basic attack to show them what I mean. Yeah. <laughs> like... What the fuck? All the things are like... Yeah, crystals are what you use to unlock different worlds. Okay. See how it says 15 on the ground? There's a bunch of other ones with different colored crystals that you find, like, in the game. That was just one of them giving you the 15 to access the first one. Uh, <laughs> you look Egyptian, actually. You're not yeah. wearing a shirt. You are not oh, this game! Oh, God. This, this game! I, I, love, I love the announcer, actually. I know, right? Because it's kind of it kind of reminds me of this old NES game, uh, Blades of Steel. This is what they do when there's a new enemy. They, oh, they give them like their little own like little short movie. Yeah, a little pre-rendered cutscene at the beginning cool. of the level for it. Yeah. Oh my goodness. So all of us have like this stupid rage. Everybody has ranged attacks. And they can go up and they'll automatically attack. If you walk into people, you do basic, you do melee attacks. Like okay. <laughs> I bitch lucky. The jester is all about speed. Yeah. And uh, there's a bunch of different button combinations. But I love this game because it is like it is so much cheese, and there's parts of it I should really hate, but I can't because I've played through it so many times, and it's just <sighs> like look at this. How can you not love this? No, game? I know. I'm having a blast, <laughs> like, and just... I'm just shooting magic balls at you. And like these, your heavy attack is even characterized differently. Like this is mine. Oh, that's... Yeah, right? Like, it's it's really cool. And this is what a special attack looks like. Wait, oh, heavy attack? Shit. What? Is heavy 
zombie attack? Yeah, I told you why. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you get them sexy lips. Use magic to kill enemies. Yeah, whenever you do something stupid, it'll, it'll basically tell you, Hey, retard, you fucked up. Here's why. <laughs> like, Be careful of death. What is that? What? That thing. Oh, that is a poisoned piece of fruit. Don't pick that up. It will lose your health. It will lose you. It will... Hey, man, it, it, and uh, you actually, like, rank up in class, and it's amazing, because, like, if, say, if you, and, like, you you get a rank up, for example, this guy goes to prankster, like, level 10, from just... Beat. I love how it comes up <laughs> down the Right? This game is sweet. Oh, it's just... I, lo I really like this. It's magic, man. Like, because I, I grew up with, like, a NES until I was about 7. Yeah. And then I got, like, my PlayStation 1. Yeah, I had an Atari for the longest time, then I got a Sega Genesis. Nice. I, I had the Game Gear, so... Oh man, my cousin had one of those. Fucking love it. How do, I, how do I do stuff with things in you here? You need a key. You need a key to open chests. It's well, like that sort of old school. Can you not, like, trap us in Jesus. the headspace? Uh, we're, we're, we're gonna uh, lose uh, Mr. T down there. <laughs> I pity the fool who tried me and in the head. Surprisingly, the character designs are actually really well. Okay, I will say that their female character designs leave a little bit to be desired, as you may be able to tell. That's like the trippiest elevator ever. Oh my goodness. But like, I don't know what to say about the chart of this game because it's it's like you know a lot of games when they try to do like ridiculous comedy. Sonic um, Boom. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, he blow he blows up his gloves. Learn how to block is what they say when you get hit by a heavy attack and you didn't block. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, watch your health, it's in the bottom there, underneath your little portrait thing. Oh, okay, I have 420. Oh. And there's secrets in this game, too. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. I assume that there was. Like, how, how do you unlock more of the characters? Um, you find you find secret switches that lead to these little things, and you have to be in a time run where characters have to collect all the coins in an area. Oh, they, it, it, it actually it takes effort, and you get one shot per level when you find it. Oh fuck! Yeah, it's it. They don't like, fuck around. Are the characters worth it though? Like... I, we never really used them much because by the time we actually unlocked one of those characters, we were like level like you know like level forty or whatever, and it, it means starting a new character, and nobody really cared that much. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> by the time, because everybody when we were kids, everybody was like a friend of mine was the blue warrior, another one was like. The Red Dwarf, I was the Yellow Jester, somebody was the Blue Wizard, shit like that, right? Yeah. Like, we all had our, like, our things. I think a nice touch about this is that fruit that gets touched by, like, the weird zombie poison mist actually yeah, turns into just, poison fruit. Yeah, it just turns into poison fruit. I noticed that earlier, yeah. You should use your super attack, man, and see what it looks like. Sweet. <laughs> it didn't do anything, but... It was cool. Yeah, it was cool. Ah, damn Ah, jeez. And the cool thing, you know, you know some spawn things, right? Like the tombstones. Yeah. Each time you hit them, they go down to a smaller version of the tombstone and small spawn weaker forms at the end. Oh, oh, sorry, dude. So it's like a tiered system for all of the enemies in the game operating like that. So a lot of people regard this as like one of the best any of the Gauntlet games. <laughs> That's her character. Oh. What's B do again? Block? Yeah. <laughs> um, Amy, I think you picked a character, if it's possible, that is more sexualized than Jessica Rabbit. Yeah, no, like she, she we were playing certain games. She had the uh, she had the sorcerer, but it was the green one, and it wasn't as bad. Yeah, but this and, and one this is one here. is uh is pretty bimbo. No, but as I was trying to say earlier, but I, I kind of lost myself. Yeah. Um. Uh, it, the the announce I see what I mean. Yeah, uh, man. The, the announcer kind of reminds me of this old NES game called uh, Blades of Steel. Yeah. And when you start up, Bla yeah, you know, when you start up Blades of Steel, and all you hear is the guy just going, Blades of Steel. Yeah, yeah. I can totally. Yeah. Yeah. I, I know. I miss that. Game. I do too. I he, love. He that. has this sort of like this just this sort of like not give a fuck cheesiness, you know. Like, stop time? What the hell? It's an item! Oh, well, the enemies cool. freeze if you use it. There's a lot of, like, power-ups and items. Yeah. Like, there's stuff like, there's, like, fire breath and shit like that. You love them. Oh, deadly. Yeah, by the way, um, your, your, your magic potions, the ones that you use, um, <laughs> damn it, that fucking... You must use your heavy attack, I want to see the effect, like... 
I'm not sure if that's terrible or really good, because the way it seems, it seems to- Oh god, I'm sorry. Shoot red barrels. Like, see what I mean? like, <laughs> Shoot red barrels. Oh, I love this game. It's uh, so good. Like, it, it has so many, like, really grimdark aspects, but it's so, like, committed to its cheesy atmosphere. Yeah. Fuck you! You know how oh. so many games, like, try to be, like, that comedy game? Yeah. The Gauntlet Dark Legacy didn't have to try. It knew exactly what it was, yeah. and it was fucking good at it. And it just did it. Yeah. I, I like that. I respect this game for that. Yeah. Because it wasn't trying to be grimdark. It's like, we're going to be as stupid and goofy and hilarious as we want. What are we doing? Um, I'm trying to get over to this. But, oh god, there's zombos! <laughs> Somebody get this. Uh, can you get over here? Remember last. Get the... So we can get the gold teeth! Gold paints. Oh, sweet. There's a bunch of random, like, senior collectibles in this game that do different things. Okay. I, for the life of me, can't remember what the gold shit does, because there's there's scent of them in every area. Alright. Why this... can't I hit? Alright. Ah! Sorry. It's okay. Alright. Oh! Oh! Like, dude, I, I, I really don't care. No, of course. <laughs> Come on! Yeah, hold on. Alright. I'm really, really, really slow. Yeah, I'm, I'm, and I'm fast because I have high speed. Yeah. Start burning, though. <laughs> oh, damn. I think one of the things you used to do, there's this ability called Super Shot. Yeah. And we bought one of those and rapid fire, and they would fly so hard that we would literally just stand at the corner of the map and fire them, and it would murder about half the level. And then we just, like, walk <laughs> until we found enemies again and do it again. Because we had this game really broken for a while. <coughs> well, oh god, oh no! <laughs> this game's so, like, I, I know, it's really hard to make, like, say anything about it, because it's just a really fun, engaging little experience. Yeah, I know, it, it, like, you you just had to experience it to be like, hey, that's really fun. Yeah, right? Like, the, the only thing, like, that's the problem with playing good video games <laughs> and doing this channel is that we have nothing to talk about and make fun of. Well, I mean, like, well, I mean, yes, there's, there's only... lots to make fun of. Like, but hey. they, they're already doing it. That's the problem. Exactly. They did our job for us, <laughs> and they did an excellent job in doing so. Yeah, I know. I think the only thing is, like, the female characterization. Normally, I don't harp on that shit so hard because I'm, like, whatever video games, but. Honestly, yeah. it's the only thing. <laughs> you know? Who gave the level? Uh, I don't know. I mean, we'll find out at the end. Uh, it was me. Oh, it was you. Oh, yeah. But, like, it's just really well designed and, and, and beautiful. And each thing has, like, a boss at the end of the final level. Yeah. And they're actually have difficult. That's bomb. You should get away from Ah! <laughs> See what his shitty is? Yeah, and, uh, he's, just like... he's just like, by the way. <laughs> Shit blows up if stuff happens to it, dickwad. He, <laughs> he like kicks you in the nuts and sleeps with your mother. What a dick. <laughs> I think oh. the funniest thing about it is whenever you like rank up in terms of your classification, like if you become a prankster for me at level 10, and say you were like actually level 13, it yeah. will see like, Yellow Jester has become a level 10 prankster, and, you're, and it will actually display level 13 on the screen despite uh. him saying that. So they could just get him in for one day just to do the level yeah. ranks because he refused to do all of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What? What did you accomplish? Uh, there was a bunch of stuff behind us. Oh. Spawners and shit. I just didn't want to be slowed down because this is running long anyway. Oh. Oh, yeah, so it is. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this game. It's just so fun. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Damn you, dwarf legs. <laughs> so, that's, that's why I never Ooh. found the slow characters interesting. The nice thing about the magic sense, okay. you know what it actually does? Oh, um, it makes. I'm, the... I'm just saying you don't auto run. Hard to block. Kiss his ass more. Kiss his ass more. I'm low on health. Oh, I thought there was a pile of vomit. Like, no, no, like... that's gold. That's what treasure looks like. Oh, okay. There's, there are still some um, cut corners in this game, to be sure. What do these little maps do? Uh, they're just like hints that give you. They, they can sometimes give you hints on like where secret walls are, or sometimes they're just like stop being a retard and learn how to block. How do block though? I think it's B. 
I honestly can't remember for sure. By the way, stay away from that really sinister looking statue. Ow! Oh, well he got murdered by the magic, that works. Oh my god, give me the cherry, I'm so low on health. Isn't this one of the levels with the secret character on it? With the what? With one of the secret characters on it. Yeah, there's a, is no, there a no, secret No, 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 that's part later. That's like the second last one. No, that's like the first, it's not this one anyway. Are you sure? Yes, positive. Uh, I played this game to death when I was a kid. I under, I know. You know. <laughs> I know, Like, man. we beat this game like six or seven times. And then oh we beat it again God. for fun. Oh, good. <laughs> like, it was one of those sort of games. This game's so fun, like... And that's how they display how much, how many kills and gold you get. Oh. I just, I just love everything about it, it's so... <laughs> Apparently you didn't merit a mention. Weird. Now I need to spend all of my money on being healed up a bit. And there's no, like, inn or anything. You have to buy healing items in these end shops oh. for you to heal yourself. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, fuck around. I only have $450. Buy some much. Jesus Christ. Yeah, there's a lot of it. You can buy basically every item in the game there. Oh, okay. I thought there was, like... I thought that was, like, B? Uh, that's B? No, no, that's money. So is that a 13? Um, no, 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 no. The B is, like, their currency symbol. Okay, because I was about to say, like, that's a lot of money. No. Alright. I never saw it like that until you brought that up. Yeah. I can see it's, like, 131000 for something. Right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm like, fucking cherries shouldn't be that expensive. Well, see you next what time is this? On 